All right. I'm doing spot edging. Oh, I'm not down that minute today, you know, but it is a given day, isn't it? Oh, it's some beautiful, it's handsome, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Puts me in mind, you know, it's so quiet out there. Puts me in mind of how it used to be down this way before the visitors started coming down. Yes, it was very quiet in the days. This was, this was before we started building the theatre, you know. This was when I used to drive the fly for Eastern Telegraph. I used to drive the fly, you know, for Eastern Telegraph. Do you know what I mean by a fly? Just like a light horse and cart, you know. The days, all oh, the modes were quiet, but they were some tight as well. The lanes, oh, you mind one time, one time, do you remember there, there was a fire down Power Colonel? They sent for the fire brigade. The fire engine come out from Penzance. He got jammed up in the lane. He did all jammed up. He did, yes, very tight, they lanes. And down our way, you would only see one or two vehicles, one or two cars. You, you might see Miss Cade. Uh, Miss Cade, she'd be out learning. Our mother taught her to drive, Mrs. Kate did. Miss Kate, she used to drive a little Fiat, little Fiat it was, like a little Fiat Coupe, with a brass radiator and a little silver horseshoe tied on the radiator for good luck. Every time Miss Kate moved cars, she'd move that radiator on for luck. You ever saw Miss Kate driving along, you would have to jump up into the side of the edge. I said to her, I said, Ten, you needs that, that silver horseshoe for luck, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, but in their days, we'd only see a few locals down our way. Uh, and Mrs. Cage, you know, Miss Cage's mother, she was a very grand lady. She was, you ever saw Mrs. Cage? She'd say to you, hello, and how are you? <laughs> very grand lady, gently she was, you know. And the vicar, you always saw the vicar, yeah. He lived just across the road from me, just across the lane, where I lived, down Rose Bungalow, you know, down by the church. And he he always knew, did the vicar, when it was baking day. He did. Yeah, every time the cakes just come out the oven, I'd look out the window, I'd say, the beer vicar's come, the beer vicar's coming, and hide the sherry. Vicar, he always knew, yeah. And then, of course, I, I was taken on, I was taken on down to down Minnock House as gardener, you know. I was only taken on for a trial of three weeks. Yeah, ended up staying there 40 years, building a theatre. Yeah. And then, of course, that's when all the visitors started coming down. They all started coming down like Morians, they were coming down like Morians. You know what I mean? Morians. Ants, you know. Yes, they all started coming down here then. Yes, <laughs> but still, eh? Be lovely, be handsome down minute now, won't it? Mind you, it is always a given day down minute. One trouble is, you never know what kind of weather you've been given. <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe. You'll oh, come down Minnock sometime. Come down the theatre. I'll tell you how we built them. I will. Yes. Look, I can't stand here gassing. I gotta get on. <laughs>